I went to the Model Secondary School for the Deaf, which is in Washington, D.C., right, right next to Gallaudet University that you were mentioning before. And, um, and they said, oh, you want to act? Come on, let's go act. You can do it. You can do it. And that was really an amazing, you know, something like, finally, somebody didn't say no to me because really, when I was uh, in the ninth grade, really, I was 14 years old, it was really the first time in my entire life that nobody had no, you, said, no, you can't do it. Yeah. And, you know, and I really could be myself, and that was a life-saving experience for me to say, it's okay to be deaf. You have something to offer as a person. Really, um, it's very uh, mm, lifting, you know, it's, it's an it's a uplifting experience in my life. See, I can relate to that because when I was in high school, I, wanted, I played drums since the fourth grade and I was pretty good at it. And I wanted to be in the marching band because I'd heard all the great times they had on all the trips and everything. So I wanted to be in in the marching band. And a guy in a wheelchair in the marching band, I mean, how are you going to be in a wheelchair and march, you know, on the football field or in parades? But my band director didn't say no. We figured out a way to mount my control box on my foot plate. And so I was a drummer in the marching band. That's so cool. Yeah, that's so cool. And that taught me a lot. That taught me about so how to just cool. ignore whatever rules, well, don't break the law, but ignore <laughs> the rules that are intended for this society that we have. You know, we have the technology to fly to the moon, you know, um, to get off this planet Earth. We have that technology. We can do anything with disabilities. We're, you know, Man, we're right we here on the, the ground. We can do anything and other yeah. things. I really appreciate about technology. Oh, I'm sorry. I really appreciate about technology is that technology is really um, resolving and la resolving barriers or, or allowing us to mesh, you know, to integrate. And I really, really look up to people who, um, who take the time with science, with technology, with inventing new things that can accommodate uh, my needs. For example, captioning. I love captioning. I, I absolutely, I love to know, I love knowing. And, and that's what, you know, I, I just love to learn. I love to communicate with people. I love to absorb information. So captioning, to me, just, you know, it, it, it engulfs me and fulfills me with information, you know? The bottom line, they can go out and spend all the money on computers, on, on, on uh, curb cuts, on putting Braille on the elevators, everything. They can do all the things that the ADA says they're supposed to do, but until the attitude is changed. None of that will matter. You know, and that's the bottom yeah. line. It's the attitude. It's people's attitude towards people with disabilities. Remember, the PC can light the way when all around you there is darkness. The proverbial light at the end of the high-tech tunnel. Hearing problems can be overcome so you can play in time and in tune with all the other high-tech musicians. Accessibility gives you the ingredients to cook up just the right dish for your meal ticket. Communicating with others is possible no matter what the disability. Hello? Oh, yeah, sure, Ron. <laughs> that was our lawyer who advises you not to throw cell phones around unless you're a seasoned professional. Accessibility on the internet, at home or your company's network, is ready and waiting to keep anyone with a disability competitive and, at the end of the day, successful. But it doesn't have to be all business. For instance, did you know that I ordered this fine bottle of champagne online? Mm -hmm. The computer gives people with disabilities the key to continued creative fertility in our electronic information-based society. In a word, it frees the egghead within. That was five words. You know, I never understood that phrase. Shall we? But of course. <sighs> okay. To accessibility. To us. To you. To, to life. life.